Hi everybody, it's Peter back for yet another video. Today I thought I'd do an album review. I'm going to do this album by Megadeth. Peace sells, but who's buying? There you go. Great cover, of course. Um, it's got eight tracks released in 1986. And in the band, uh, the lineup for this was Dave Mustaine, of course. David Ellefson, uh, Chris Poland and Gar Samuelson. The tracks are... Uh, the eight tracks, Wake Up Dead, The Conjuring, Peace Cells, Devil's Island, Good Morning Black Friday, uh, Bad Omen, I Ain't Superstition and My Last Words. Now this is considered one of their best albums. I love the album as well. So um, I've heard it a lot over the years and I um, before the review I went over it a few times again just uh, to prepare for the review. Although I knew the songs well, but I still did it. Okay, it starts off with Wake Up Dead. One of the greatest Megadeth songs in my opinion. Just um, um, tells um, the lyrics about him cheating on his uh, woman. And <laughs> that's, uh, that's about the um, that's about what's, what, what it's about. And uh, one of their greatest songs and one of my favourites from the album. A fantastic uh, song by Megadeth. Then we got The Conjuring. Um, I really like it a lot. Not as much as Wake Up Dead, but I like it a lot. And it's uh, it just it rocks out. Um, typical Megadeth uh, thrash metal um, um, thrash metal style. And uh, it's it's not my favorite on the album, but I love the so I like the song a lot. Uh, that's The Conjuring. Now we get to Peace Cells. Just a, a catch. A, a great catchy uh, thrash song um one of their one of their um their greatest songs and my personal favorite off the album i think um peace sells but um a lot of good songs on this one and uh, still to this day they play this song and it's uh just one of their greatest i think and now this uh next song devil's island which i love actually it's um it's a great song and um the, the guitar works are awesome, of course, with Megadeth, as always. And, um, yeah, this would be in my top three or four off the album. Definitely Devil's Island. Really love it. And this one has got Good Morning. It's got sla Good Morning Slash. Good Morning as in morning. You're morning somebody. Not <laughs> That's how it's spelled. Good Morning. Black Friday. Uh, really... Starts off slowly and then uh, builds up and uh, just rocks out. And one of my favorite, I love it. One of my favorites off the album, most definitely. Good morning, Black Friday. Uh, Bad Omen. Uh, I wouldn't say I love it. It's 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 decent. It's decent, but I wouldn't say I, lo I love the song. Um, yeah, that's all I could say about that. But uh, it's decent enough. Um, it's likable. Uh, the cover is I Ain't Superstitious, um, probably the weakest uh, part of the album for me. Uh, it's not too bad, but nothing to write home about either. But um, yeah, it's it's the cover on the album, and that's all I could say about that. Um, and then it ends with the f fantastic My Last Words. Uh, one of the, uh, They still play this from time to time, I believe. I haven't seen them for a while, but... Um, uh, I only seen them once, but um, while a lot few years back, but um, um, I st I think they still play this from time to time, but it, it's a great ending to the um, it's a great song as well. My last words. So I'll just uh, for um, I'll, I'll give you my top three off the album. I go um, and then I'll give you my rating for the um. I got a piece sells. I think it'd be my favorite. And then I go um, Wake Up Dead, second. And I might go Devil's Island as the third track, my third favourite. But all in all, a great album. Um, a couple of songs towards the end aren't as good as the rest, but um, pretty pretty great album from uh, Megadeth. Uh, pretty great album. There it is. This is the uh, original tour. It's not the uh, remixed and remastered that uh, Dave did of the first um, 
eight albums, I believe he did. Um, a re, he did a remix and a remaster of those albums. But there you have it. Okay, out of ten, uh, pretty high rating this for this one. Uh, yeah, I'd go nine point five out of ten for this one. It's just that those um, like the Bad Omen, which is good, and I ain't superstitious, probably pull it down a little, but. Close to a 10 without being a 10, I'd say. 9.5 out of 10, I give this. Uh, Megadeth piece sells, but who's buying? Okay. Now, I hope you enjoyed this uh, Megadeth review. I'll do another Megadeth one, and I might do some Metallicas. I'm going to step up the album reviews, because I, while I've been on YouTube, I haven't done that many album reviews. I've done probably seven in the whole time I've been on. But, um, yeah, there you have it. 9.5 out of 10. Megadeth, peace cells, but who's buying? Okay, hope you enjoyed it and bye for now, bye.